John Oliver has ruffled some feathers after he launched a global campaign delivering the Puteki Teki to victory in New Zealand's Bird of the Century contest. However, the last week tonight host might be forgiven for interfering in the competition after a record half a million dollars was raised for conservation. It's election interference New Zealanders didn't see coming. Like a vulnerability in their system that somebody could exploit, we were happy to be that somebody. It's meant to be a humble competition for Kiwis to crown the country's bird of the century. That was until the Puteki Teki got an unexpected wingman. And we campaigned for it by, among other things, flying a banner ad over the beaches of Ipanema and erecting billboards in Mumbai, Tokyo and Paris, France. After a flying start, last week tonight host John Oliver delivered the competition a record 380,000 votes. Locking together with Jimmy Fallon, the other birds didn't stand a chance, with the Puteki Teki receiving 76% of the vote. Puteki Teki, Teki. We didn't just win this by a little, we won it by a lot. People put their money where their mouth is, and so we've had uh, an additional $600,000 since John Oliver has been uh, running his crazy in the best way campaign. As chief executive of the organisation that's just received this unexpected significant bump uh, in funding, I would say all is forgiven, John. This is what democracy is all about. America interfering in foreign elections. Jack Nyhoff, Sky News, Wellington.